welcome back to TACOM eLearning. The TACOM portal allows us to manage the different users of our tech organization. In this video, we show you how to add, modify, delete, and customize access for any user in our organization. Let's take a look. Before we start, it's necessary to differentiate between two types of users at TechLab. On the one hand, we have the administrator profile. The administrator has rights over the organization and can manage business relationships between partners, apply changes to the account and also manage users. The second type of profile is the user. In this case, the user only has access to place orders and inquiries and also to monitor the transactions. In any case, all access can be limited by the administrator. By default, the person who creates the tech organization is always given an administrator profile, and this person is in charge of adding the new members to the tech organization. To be able to add a new user, both administrator and user, we need to be in an administrator profile within a tech organization. From the main menu, navigate to administration on the left side menu and click on users. In the right hand corner, we see in blue two options to add users. The first option, add user, allows us to add a single user with a custom configuration. On the other hand, with the second option, import users, we can import several users at the same time through a CSV file. Later we will explain how to import users, but for the moment we will focus on the first option and click on Add User. Enter the email address of the new user and repeat the process on the line below. Click on Next. At the top we see all the necessary data to complete the user profile. In the lower part we can choose between administrator and user. If we decide to create an administrator, we can see that the different access options are blocked, as users with administrator rights have full access. Otherwise, if we choose a user account, we can limit access with the multiple options available to us. Once the user profile has been configured, click on Save, and after a few seconds, we will see that a new user is already part of our organization. At this moment, the registered user will receive an email with the access to our tech organization. TechHom also offers the option to import users in bulk via the Import Users option. If we click on the button, we will see that we have two types of templates available to load the user data in CSV format. In the English version, the fields are separated by commas. On the other hand, the German version has the fields separated by columns. Download the template of your choice and fill it with the necessary data for the registration. Once we have the file, we import it into the system through the option Select Import File. After a few seconds, we can see the different options we have seen previously. In this case, the chosen configuration will be applied to all the users of the CSV file. If we want to give different rights, we will have to repeat the process for each group of users sharing the same configuration. Once we have selected the configuration for the group of users, click on Save. And in a few seconds, you will be able to see how the users have been correctly added to the tech organization. In case we want to delete a user from our tech organization, we only need to log in with our administrator account and navigate again to Administration, Users, and select the user we want to delete. Once inside the user profile, we observe that we can modify again the type of user and the rights that we want to give him. And on the right side, we see a small bin that will allow us to delete the user from the organization. Click on it and a message will appear to confirm the action. 
We accept the message and in a few seconds we will see that the user has been correctly deleted from the organization.